So I know this is a cooking show and we don't normally do like unboxings or uh, toy reviews because it's a cooking show. It's a professional cooking show nonetheless. But I want to showcase the new Overwatch Funko Pop. Get it? Because uh, Overwatch is salty and this is Morton Salt. Okay, that was stupid. Today we're going to be making our favorite Frog Boys lemonade recipe. What? I know that says limeade, but this is basically lemonade just with green lemon. <laughs> I don't know of any single kid that didn't try to make a lemonade stand because they see it on the cartoons. People have to go to you. And I don't think anyone in this day and age is trying to buy lemonade off the street from a child. It's not like there's going to be any drugs in it. It's probably just gonna be trash. <laughs> but we're not just gonna be making Lucio's limeade recipe. We're also gonna be making some... I, I still don't know what these are. <laughs> Let's just get this out of the way. We're gonna need eggs. Oh, I didn't want it to go everywhere. It got on the camera. No, oh, I'm sorry. This has to be like an ASMR thing where you're a baby and your mom is like taking care of you. Except I'll be the last person to be qualified to be a mother because anyone that sees me as a parent figure would probably just die. All right, so after five minutes of cleaning and $50 off of my security deposit, we can finally redo this. Two eggs, uncracked in case you guys didn't know. You need to go and milk a cow for some milk, milk a goat for some cheese, and milk a vegetable for some vegetable oil. We also need a tapioca flour blizzard. What the fudge is tapioca flour? So I looked online, I'm gonna use cornstarch. If this doesn't work, then it's Lucio's and Blizzard's fault, not mine. And to start this recipe off, we're gonna be doing the one thing that I know I can't mess up, that hopefully I've proven myself wrong worse before. We're gonna go to the oven. Start! I turned it off, okay, well. And then we get our rolling paper, not for weed, uh, unfortunately, and we just kinda Yo, that was, well, I was gonna say it's a perfect rip. Bruh. Uh, and then we're gonna get a, s a saucepan, milk, oil, <laughs> add the butter without the wrapper. I think they assume that, but in this day and age, you can't assume anything. And then we take the new Overwatch Hero, Hero 32 confirmed, and we only add a teaspoon of salt, unfortunately. And then we're gonna take our wooden spoon. That was cringy. I did not need to do that. Why didn't it ask me to melt this? Yo, hold on. Big brain moment. What if I just put this over the heat and let the butter melt? I am so smart. So I'm gonna show you complex technique. All right, so you basically turn the dial on your stove, right? And you just turn it to medium heat. Oh my God! If this doesn't prove that I'm the number one chef, then I don't know what does. So while we wait for that, we're gonna do something I haven't done on the show before, and that is grate my cheese. Now, normally I just go to the store and um, buy pre-made craft cheese. N not because I'm cheap, it's because I'm broke. But I bought a cheese crater. See, I'm investing in this show. It was a dollar. Remember, I'm broke, y'all. Honestly, though, the dollar store is low-key the goat. All right, um, never grated cheese before. <laughs> Which hole do I use? That's what she said. <laughs> uh, oh, that's actually working out very... <laughs> well, that's not cash money. Oh, would you look at that? You didn't even get to see, but look at my efforts. Oh, that is beautiful. Yo, shouts out to the dollar store. Out of all the sponsors I want, I want the dollar store. Like, that would be the biggest flex of all time. Shut a little hole, shall we? <laughs> that's what they used to call me back in high school. Yo, hold on, pause for a second. Look at this, this is so cute. Look at this straight cheese. I don't even know if this is a cup. I just like grating cheese now. That's my new hobby. Now, unfortunately, I didn't uh, need to buy Parmesan blocks because it already comes pre-grated. Next time, you know I'll be more than happy to grate my own Parmesan. You know what, while we're waiting for that to boil, let's just grate the rest of this cheese. I love this. Uh... <laughs> ah! So while we're playing, basically ourselves with the cheese. I brought this to a boil. Now we gotta move this and we basically take a shot of it. And then after we cause a sort of serious pain, we do a little flip a -roo and we gotta combine the, uh, the, the tapio flour. We're combining our cornstarch, okay? Okay, so we get... I hate life. A and then we... Uh, well, and then we mix until we don't have any uh, dry lumps, but it's okay if it's a little bit lumpy, if it has some cellulite. Was it cornstarch or cornmeal that was a substitute? Okay, so for whatever reason, the oil is not getting picked up. <laughs> it's fine, you know what, it's fine, we're fine. I, we're not fine, I'm just saying that. Let's just plop her down in this medium mixing bowl. Oh, that's so disgusting. Okay, so we have to be with a hand mixer, which I do have, but now we got a different problem. I don't know which one's the hand mixer. We got one that looks like a whisk, and we got one that looks like my ex-girlfriend, a snake. Let's just go with my ex-girlfriend. I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> we gotta 
beat this. I hope I'm beating it. Let's just do the one-handed technique, oh! please, shall we? Let's go! All right, boys, now it's my time. Ah! And then it's the Parmesan, my favorite cheese. All right, look, look at that. That's a smooth texture. All right, boys, let's form this into the size of golf balls. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's disgusting. <laughs> uh, sir, I don't think this is gonna... Uh, sir, this isn't coming off. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna plaster it on there and hope for the best. You know, this, this is working out nice. No, it's not. You know, instead of these being rolls, I'm pretty sure these are just gonna be Lucio cheese cookies. <laughs> Alright, guys, here's our Lucio cheese <laughs> rolls. What is that? What is that? What? I don't know what happened. Like, why couldn't I just use regular cooking flour? Why did I ask for a tapatio, ta tapanga, tapanga flour? So I said, F it. Cheese cookies. Take our first uh, beautiful batch of Lucio what cheese the cookies and slam the door and turn on the timer because you just want to crap. I turn it on for 10 hours. And then you bake this homie for 25 minutes and you cue a SpongeBob time card. Meanwhile. You didn't see what happened, but <laughs> I don't drink cold water because I'm a commentator. I need my vocal cords to be nice and loose, just like your mom's You often see my burner right there just collecting water because I like room temperature water. But this next recipe for the limeade calls for cold water, so I have the bright idea to freeze my water so that I can get cold water faster. Well, this cup froze, and so did this one, but only the top, and... I, I just kind of went like this, the ice broke, and then water just went everywhere on my counter. So there's one step to make this, but this is like one of those homework questions that has 1A, 1B, 1C, 1D, all the way to like the 37th letter in the alphabet. We need to zest limes. Don't know what zesting means still. Hey Siri, what does it mean to zest a lime? Here's what I found. I gotta read for real? to use the cheese grater again while zesting? I would have done this a long time ago. We got some zest that kind of looks like Keith. And then we gotta cut these limes. The only problem is my only cutting board is being occupied. <laughs> One, two, three. You thought I was gonna slam the knife into the lime. I wouldn't be that stupid. Yes, I would. Nope. Well, that didn't work out. And then we gotta juice these bad boys. <laughs> you know, I just wanna see what a lime tastes like just straight up raw. Also, my limes came with little tiny stickers. I don't know if you're supposed to add it for this recipe, but I like the flavor. And then we're just gonna crack a cold one open with the boys. Um, some nice condensed milk. <laughs> a third cup of sugar. I would add more, but I don't want diabetes. And then we get two cups of water. Again, I would add more, but I still don't want diabetes. Then it says we need to stir. Then pour through a strainer. And then stir again. B -b -b Blizzard, what do you think I am? You think I'm the number one chef? I am. Well, I don't have all these supplies. But I lied. I do have a strainer. And just in case this one's too big, Aww. I got a sign. <laughs> oh, I can see why they wanted me to do it. Because they wanted me to keep the key for later. Oh, well, uh, it worked out as good as it could have. My hands are sticky. My kitchen's a mess. I'm sad because I'm lonely. And then it says we got to stir with ice. Blizzard, I'm not made of money. I don't have ice. It's just so inconsiderate how Blizzard just assumes you have stuff. A strainer, ice, a spoon, a life. <laughs> nice pour, nice pour. Oh, that's too much. It's fine. Oh my god, that's so perfect. All right, boys, let's see how these turned out. Oh my god, they're beautiful. <laughs> oh my god, look at how cute these are. And I figured while we're drinking lemonade, we would not get more plastic straws to kill the turtles, and we would get reusable straws. And then the final and hardest part about this recipe. Oh, baby. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we have our cheese cookies and limeade. Honestly, if you looked at this, you would just think it's milk and cookies. But no, nope. look at them. They legit look like cookies, but they're not. They're supposed to be rolls. All right. Right, here we go. Um, they're not bad, but they're just an object that I'm eating. And I know that sounds weird, but I feel like I'm just eating a ball of dough with a hint of cheese. And maybe that's what they're supposed to taste like. But then again, that's not very uh, appealing to me, honestly. <laughs> Look at the inside. It straight up looks like a cookie. Let's try our limeade. Oh, that's sour! 
So, okay, so this isn't like last week's recipe where it's just bad. What the fudge is all this? But I, I think I made the right idea of it. Like, it it's just flat. And just like your girlfriend, it's okay to be flat. But if it was up to me, I, I, I would rather just have a girlfriend that's not compared to cheese cookies. <laughs> it's just so dry. Like, mm. And then the lemonade or lemonade. I mean, it, it's actually pretty good. I'm just not a fan of lemonade. <laughs> I'm a sweet boy. I like sweet things. This is literally the opposite of that. <laughs> but guys, I'll about do it for this Lucio recipe. Honestly, like, it was a success for not really knowing what I was making and low-key messing up. But uh, it's okay. We're the number one chef. We made cheese cookies. But I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Oh, oh that's a rush of adrenaline. Crackheads need this. <laughs> love you guys. And bye.